there's three uh, elements I believe that we need to look at when speaking on this topic, effective communication. Now effective communication defined is when the listener interprets correctly what the speaker is trying to say to them or information that they're trying to give to them. So if I say, um, I don't like you, <laughs> and the listener understands that 100%, then that's effective communication. Now, effective communication between you and your staff, um, as in, say, other staff within the club, bar staff, should be uh, direct but friendly. The reason it should be friendly is because they don't work directly with you. They're kind of on the side there at times, so, you know, the reason why you need to be friendly to them is to keep that connection, keep that sort of relationship, that friendly relationship, and then that, you know, reinforces trust. And respect there too um, so it's kind of different to with your security team your security team you know you need to talk about a lot of things you spend a lot of time talking between your security team so that they understand where you come from on a on a certain topic like your approach to things how you feel about things if they're not aware that you uh, really hate this guy because he gave your missus a hard time at another club or whatever then uh, when you go to throw him out and you're a bit heavy-handed with him which you shouldn't be um, but if they weren't aware of that they're not able to help you, you see. So um, if you've got any sort of drama or problems, you really want to be close enough and have the trust of your team uh, and respect of your team to be able to tell them those things. Um, because, it, you know, you've got to entrust your life to these people and, you know, they've got to be able to trust you with their life too. If someone walks in, they've got a knife or a gun or whatever, you need to trust the awareness and skill and experience of those people to be able to respond effectively and work as a team to uh, you know, shut down that situation, have it on lockdown, and uh, you know, restore the peace kind of thing.